Well, this is the time of year when you see Girl Scouts at the grocery store, maybe even knocking on your front door to sell their cookies. Well, one local scout can't do those things, but she is still hoping to break the cookie sales record. Local 12's Tiffany Wilson talks with those rallying to help her out, and she also shows how you can help out, too. To put it simply, this is a story about a little girl's quest to sell cookies and win an iPad. But no story is ever that simple. It started in June of 2013. Becky Blevins was heading out of town for work when she got a call. A call that changed everything. She said, there's something wrong with Emily. And I, she said she's having a seizure. Up until that moment, Emily had been a healthy, happy child, playing t-ball, checking out a fire truck, cheering her mom in a race. She was never sick, ever. Like, I mean, the occasional swallow a magnet, marble maybe, fall off a bike, but nothing to that extreme. The seizure led doctors to discover a brain tumor. I'm, I was numb. Just days later, Emily was wheeled into surgery. Amazingly, she rebounded with the energy only a seven-year-old can summon. Only full recovery never came. If I could take it all away, I would. Emily suffers through multiple migraines a week. It's like when you get hurt, it's how it feels. Dance classes triggered another set of seizures. So now Becky tries to keep her daughter occupied with activities that are quiet and at home. That's why Emily wants an iPad. Do you have a favorite game? Mm -hmm. What? Subway Surfers. When she found out she could win an iPad by becoming the top Girl Scout cookie seller in the country, she set her sights high. So far, from friends spreading the message, Emily has managed to sell about 250 boxes. Becky now hopes more members of the community will order cookies to help Emily achieve her dream. It shows a little girl that anything's possible. What a sweetheart. And that was Tiffany Wilson reporting. And anything is possible, including beating the tumor. Over the holidays, Emily spent five days in the hospital, and unfortunately, it seems that a second surgery is necessary now. If you would like to order Girl Scout cookies from Emily, her mom is asking that you send an email. And here's that address. It's blevinsr2 at nku.edu. And it's right there on the screen for you.